Now, back to Louisiana Living. And welcome back. I'm here with Carrie with the LSU Ag Center for this week's In the Garden. As Jared said, haven't seen you since last year, I know. Carrie. It's Happy been a 2024. Whole year. Same to you. Same to everybody here. Good so to be we're back. today we're talking about cool weather mushrooms. The mushrooms yeah. are having their moment right now. People yeah. are eating them. Uh, we're learning about more health benefits with mushrooms. That's right, and they're really popping now in the landscape because we're having a mild winter so far mm -hmm. for the most part, and with episodic rains and some of the mild temperatures mushrooms are really going and they are seasonal we have cool season mushrooms and warm season mushrooms and here are some of the cool season ones you might see this uh, first picture comes to us from Michael Sandifer over in Monroe found this just this morning I believe <laughs> this is a cluster of uh, wood rotters called gymnopilus that's the genus name for them fungal taxonomy is very different uh, very difficult I should say so trying to put a species on that is um, almost impossible without looking at some other features but a lot of these fun you'll find on stumps and logs and things like that. Um, that's a cool one. That's That one's mm -hmm. in a cluster, uh, golden yellow like that. The next one is a, a puff ball that we, you'll find on the ground. This is like a perdon and uh, they're real spiky and uh, the spore mass is on the inside there. A pore will form on the top and you'll see the puff of smoke, uh, which are the, the spores coming out of it. And then another one that will open up rather like a flower this is in my yard. This is called scleroderma. Um, it opens up like a flower like that and the spores are on the inside. Um, it looks, uh, for folks old enough to know who Jughead is, that looks like Jughead's hat. Or it opens up like that. <laughs> and uh, so those are some of the ones you see. And people uh -huh. have a lot of questions about edibility, of course. Yeah. But of course, never, have, never uh, eat a wild mushroom unless you have it identified. Some of them are not edible, but they're not really toxic either not dangerously so those are more warm season mushrooms uh, but you want to make sure you have them identified uh, by an expert just in case mm -hmm. so uh, what what are these things anyway um, mushrooms are really fungi that are reproducing the rest of the fungus is down in the soil or in the case of that wood rotter down in the woody tissue of the log it's decomposing and that's what their function is in our landscape they function as decomposers and uh, this time of year they're not usually a problem they just look odd some of the stink horns will come up mm -hmm. too right now and I'm seeing a lot of those posted on the gardening uh, social media pages um, and uh, they they, un they uh, look unusual but they have this odor that kind of freaks people out yeah, when I they uh, when they encounter those so so kicking over a mushroom does that cause that in a spore spread does that cause more mushrooms to grow in your yard it will certainly uh, help with spore dispersal but the rest of the fungus is still down in the soil, so you're not really getting rid of the fungus by pulling up the mushroom or kicking it over. Mm -hmm. The fungus is still down there and will fruit the following season if the mycelium survives. So. Okay. Well, we're going to go to a break, but we'll be back more with Carrie Hefner, and we're going to talk about what to do with that Christmas tree that uh, may still be up in your living room or your home. You can actually recycle it, and uh, there are a lot of ways to do that. And then we'll also be talking about the chill hours. That's right. All right. So we're going to go to a break, but we'll be back. Stay with us. Trade names are used by the LSU Ag Center for clarity and information purposes only. Neither commercial endorsement of specific products nor a recommendation to the exclusion of similar products is implied. 